said last night, the only good fucking thing that's ever happened to QLA is a motherfucking Corona-Rona. I, didn't, I was so fucking happy, I didn't know whether to shit or go blind. And all the things I've said are, are going to get worse. Which is better for us. This is our fucking time. Yes, some of you in this room won't take advantage of it. All those letters and awards I've got and $5 won't buy me a coffee latte at Starbucks. Some of you got a lot of letters after your name. And how's your program worked out? Full-time professors at Harvard make $235,000 a year. Full-time professors at Oxford and Cambridge make less. Of course, they write books and shit like that. But it's, it's a very rare professor that makes a million dollars a year. He's got to be on Oprah and CNBC and uh, Good Morning fucking Britain and, to make any money. Yet they're learned people, aren't they? Most people don't have the balls to say they have no balls, even if they know it categorically. Most cover their inadequacies up with jargon that is popular at the time or mere platitudes. But based on my high performance in seven decades, having no balls is mostly masked by procrastination. Remember what I said, those who take, you're not gonna get these cocksuckers, remember. Those who take the most notes have a higher probability of making it. Those that have to take no notes almost assuredly will fail. And remember, you don't, contrary to your previous life, you of wanting to know why, all you should be concerned about is how. And I know it's not popular to chase, uh, chase getting laid anymore and all that shit, but I, I, I didn't care why they fucked me. I mean, are you kidding me? Just fuck me, sweetheart. Once in a while I said, the how, well now can you turn it a little this way? Can you? But other than that, I didn't give a shit why. Everything working? Hey, we turn the air conditioner on. This room is one of the three buildings, big buildings in all of Scotland that is coroned with a ventilation and the air conditioning system by accident. Now we're supposed to keep the doors open, but you're such weenies. I mean, you, 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 you go like this. You're gonna go like this in a couple hours just because the air conditioner is gonna go on. Now, what, what are the odds of us having the only coroned building that can take, we can see 450 here, um, they call it theater style, anyway, you know what I mean? By accident. See, I'd rather be lucky than smart. You'd rather be smart than lucky. And again, how's your program working out? Now, I'm gonna say this again. I've been saying this for 28 years when we only had six billion people. This is for the point zero 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 one on the planet. That's it. That doesn't mean all these people are gonna be billionaires. Only about 750,000 are capable because they got the sacks, the balls, the grit, the fortitude to do these things to make the human sacrifices required. That's it. That's it. And Corona Rona has, not that I needed any validation, has validated my numbers. And when we start going through the cases, not case studies, but the cases, and you look at these people, and I said last night, fuck, that fucking weenie, or that fucking fat bitch. Well, God, I ought to be able to do it. But not many of you do. Not many of you do.
Now, as far as I know, I'm the only guy that's coaching, teaching, mentoring, that's created millions, tens of millions, hundreds of millions, billions, tens of billions, and hundreds of billions of dollars. As far as I know. And one of you cocksucker weenie dick licks, if there was a guy, you'd tell me within a, a micro fucking second. You'd be on Reddit. You'd be on this, you'd be on that. Wouldn't you, you cunts? So as soon as somebody does something like this, I will hear about it instantaneously. And here, here to four, to date, nobody. And all of a sudden, I'm an overnight uh, success after 25 years. Because I was ex ex saying and preaching and espousing the exact same messages that you're going to get this week since uh, May 28th, 1993, my first seminar. But Bruce the Whipple was in attendance. And of the people in attendance at that seminar, there's seven Hall of Famers. Seven out of 60. When you can take a meathead with an 80 IQ and have him walk away with $70 million in seven months, you are God. And I am. I am the motherfucking come again Christ. Because nobody, not one motherfucker on this planet has done what I've done. I don't think that face looks like me and I ne my beard was never that long, but uh, be that as it may. These are world-class coaches of the past. Woody Hayes, Bobby Knight, Bear Bryant, John Wooden, and me. Woody Hayes, football, Bobby Knight, basketball, Bear Bryant, football, John Wooden, basketball. The top three guys hit their, their students, athletes, hit them with chairs, hit them with baseball bats, punched them in the face. Bear, uh, Woody Hayes, uh, the, the uh, Ohio State was playing, I believe, believe it was either Vanderbilt or Clemson, which had a lesser football program than Ohio State. And uh, back got around his corner and was running for a touchdown. Woody Hayes threw down his clipboard, took off his headset and tackled the motherfucker himself rather than let the little fucking weenie score. He lost his job over that. He knew he was gonna lose his job. But he would rather die than let a Clemson or Vanderbilt cocksucker score on him. That's what it takes. John Wooden, the wizard of uh, Westwood, uh, who I knew personally, was just the opposite. He And he won, I believe, 10 out of 12 NC2A National Basketball Championships. But there's only one John Wooden. And you the fuck aren't them, aren't him. In the 90s, I hit you. I had people, Dan, I want to remember you. I broke their jaw. You remember you, you fucking cocksucker with your wired up mouth. But in the last 15 or 20 years, men have gone to shit. The average handshake of a, a man in the uh, 80s was 105 pounds pressure. A woman, 88 pounds pressure. You know what it is today? An average man is 70 pounds pressure and a woman is 75 pounds pressure. Testosterone levels have dropped in the last 15, 20 years. We're fucked, which makes it good for us. This old man just broke the record. He did a deal from beginning to end in seven fucking days. He attended the July 2019 seminar. He's 65 fucking years old. 
Seven fucking, because I told people, what could you do in, uh, I'm probably doing three or four days. Uh, let's say seven days. You know, uh, you know. Seven days. He got in the boxing ring when we had boxing. And a 20 year old kid kicked the shit out of him. Well, guess what? Get knocked down, get up again. Boom, boom, boom. Get knocked down, get up again. Got knocked down, got up again. Got knocked down, get up again. You stay down. He broke the original record, one deal in 73 days. He's now done 32 deals in 24 months and one of them, most recently, in seven days. Now this is what's possible. This is what, during the Corona Rona, he, he, he hopes Corona lasts the rest of his fucking life. He hasn't had so much fun since the hogs ate his baby brother. Because it is fun doing deals. It is. Now, <clears throat> I'm, I'm announcing today, I'm putting my ass on the line. I, I'm telling you, there is a black swan event coming. A black swan event coming. I don't know if it's go we're going to war with Putin. I don't know if another Corona Rona is going to come out uh, that is not curable. I don't know uh, uh, whether the Federal Reserve is going to finally implode. I don't know what it is, but it's coming. Because every massive bull market needs to find an excuse to correct. 